come back to the island of mist. We've been here a little while, exploring and solving a couple puzzles, and we have a couple of things to try. From that tower, we retrieved some dates, which we can input into this planetarium to show us the stars. But also, we saw this note earlier, and it said, Enter the number of marker switches on this island into the imager to retrieve the message. We've explored to the edge of the island, and I think there are a total of eight marker switches. So before we move ahead with the planetarium, I'd like to try to input the number of marker switches into the imager and see what happens. before, so now we're going to try this one. So that seems to be a message from Atris to Catherine. Sounds like one of their sons sabotaged them somehow. Sounds rather tragic. And I think since the message was still accessible that Catherine never received this message. I wonder what happened to her. He said he suspected Akinar. I think Akinar was the one in the blue book. He seemed a little unstable. I feel a little nervous about bringing either of them their pages, but also a little too curious not to. But in the meantime, okay, so let me 
check my notes here. first date I wrote down was October 11th, 1984 10.04 a.m. So what's pointed us to this star grouping, which to me looks like a constellation. Okay, let's try the next one. January 17th. 5.46 a.m. Six fifty seven PM Another constellation. Okay. Well, I'm sure those images will come in handy at some point. I think what I want to do next is flip the marker switch for the planetarium and see what the tower shows us. There doesn't seem to be a tower rotation for the planetarium specifically. Perhaps it's just that the ship and the planetarium are the same in terms of the clues that they have, because when we were looking over here at the ship, we got the dates to input into the planetarium. So maybe each one doesn't have its own marker switch. Or maybe each one doesn't have its own tower rotation. In 
In that case, I think the next thing I want to try... ...is I want to look at these symbols and see if any of them appear to be... ...the constellations. This leaf looks like the first constellation we looked at. Hmm. That one looks similar to the last one we looked at. conceivably be a snake. So I'll try that. Um, but nothing is happening. So perhaps I got them wrong. But maybe I will flip this marker switch and see if this one has a tower rotation. It's appeared on the map now, at least. But it doesn't seem to have its own tower rotation. something, but I don't really know what it could be. It's possible I got the constellations wrong, but perhaps instead of the anchor, perhaps it's the insect. of that. Here we are on this ship that was sunk and I thought it would be wrecked, but no, it was just hidden. a book. And I'll bet it's a book that we can enter. Okay. I see a lighthouse. I see rocks. I wonder if this is going to take us to the stone ship age, which we read about in the last video. Oh, it's raining. I 
remember when when Atris first came here was when they had their first rainstorm and they were so frightened by it before I arrived it had been sunny all the time Looks like the same ship, just a copy of it, I guess. But if I try to go down below, it's filled with water. I wonder if that means we're stuck here until we're able to get the water out somehow. Um, okay. I gotta admit, none of these paths look very inviting. This one leads into a stone corridor, off which I can't go very far anyway, since it's also filled with water. This, uh, sorry excuse for a bridge is leads to some switches, maybe? Check those out in a second. This, also not a bridge, takes us to the lighthouse. They were so excited about the lighthouse that they'd constructed it with their own hands. And it was how they met the other people who lived in this age. Although it's certainly empty now. I wonder where everyone went. Lighthouse, also filled with water. There's this chain here with a key on it. I can't seem to do much with it. Hmm. It probably goes into this lock, but it's attached to the chain. the other half of the boat, the ship boat, whatever it is. Also filled with water. Possibly that's why all the people left. Everything flooded and it rained forever. where they saw lights flashing on distant shores. It looks like the lighthouse. I can only look side to side, I can't look up and down. lighthouse is at 135 degrees. I wonder if that will be useful later. I'm 
Okay, so I'm going to go do the only thing I can really seem to do right now, which is press these buttons over here. I'm gonna press the center one and see what it does. seems to have pumped out the water from this imposing stone passageway. So here we go. There can't be anyone down here, it was full of water. fish or this green light oh, there's even water dripping from the walls that's a nice touch okay big green button let's push it well now this this is a fancy bedroom my goodness to have this room buried in stone underneath the ocean. Someone here knows how to live in style. I want to get a closer look at what's in here. Well, it looks like bottles, a syringe. Medicine or drugs, I'm not sure. Is that just the bottom of the door? No, I'm not sure what that is. We have some dishes. Fabric, different fabric types. Empty. And a red page. Does that mean this was Cirrus's room? Perhaps this gives some insight into his character. You can learn a lot about someone from their bedroom. Well, 
I hope I haven't missed anything. So we have this red page with us now. But we are at present unable to get back to the Mist Island. these other buttons does. Okay, looks like only one button works at a time. see well enough to make this decision, so I'm gonna back out. Uh, uh, possibly there's some way to turn the power on. Perhaps the same thing that will power the lighthouse. Let's try that. putting the page into something, but I think this icon here is just to show that I'm holding the page. So, I've drained the water that was in this chest. Perhaps that means when it fills with water again, it will float. And maybe the key goes into that keyhole. Let's try it. There's power here. How do I get power to the ship? Maybe I don't. Maybe I'm just supposed to go into the dark. Possibility. I suppose we'll find out. Well, there are power lines here, and they look rather conspicuous, so I'm not sure. Aha! I was right. Okay, let's try this. Let's see, the key fits into this lock, and... There's another key. I wonder where this one goes. Alright, up the ladder, and in the center of the lighthouse now, there seems to be a hand crank. And what looks 
looks like some battery cells. So let's charge them and see what happens. The lights are on in here. But it's really dark. I need to find a power switch for that room. I don't see any switches. There's one place we haven't looked yet, which is the passageway over here, down into what I presume will be Akinar's room. I think I remember from the book, Atrus saying he brought his sons here. Looks frightening. I'll go down that way in a second. And here's the other bedroom. Quite a different style. This lamp seems to be made out of a rip cage. I want one. Bottles of poison, antlers, somewhat intimidating looking masks. either a cartographer or a map or travel enthusiast. Have a page here. Marker switch. Don't know what that one says. The vault is located at the island of achieved very cat Instructions are full. Each of the marker turn every one of on position. Then 
as a final step to there to the I wonder what happened to the other half of the page well since I'm here I might as well grab the blue page and I'll be on my way to this lovely like an observation point. You can see fish out there. And this other passageway does this to the hallway that led to Akinar's room or Cirrus's room. see this conspicuous red square and it looks like here we have some sort of compass These look like buttons. Remember earlier we looked into that uh, telescope and we saw that the lighthouse was at 135 degrees? Maybe, maybe this is where that applies. So if this is north and this is zero degrees, South would be 180, East would be 90, and I think in between 90 and 180 would be 135 degrees. There we go. It's noticeably brighter in here. Maybe that means our ship will be lit up. House beacon is shining. I wonder if anyone else will see the light or if they're all so far away now. It 
it's uh, a little more empty than I expected. It sort of looks like there should be a book on this table and there's not. that awaits us is to put in the red and the blue pages and I think we'll be doing that next time we play thank you for joining me on this exploration until next time